Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. As you see me in the car, so you know we are going on a road trip. So I will take you to a place which you can easily go on a road trip from Oslo. That's Frederick Star. So let's go. that Fredrikstad is not very far from Oslo it's around one hour and 20 minutes drive from Oslo we were accompanied by our friends Achal and Nancy so it was a nice drive to the place The sad part is that the weather was not very nice. It started raining heavily as the prediction but it got better with time. As you see the train track here, you can even take a train to this place which is even faster and with this amazing view, imagine if you have a train in between that. I would like to try that someday. So finally we parked the car and we reached our first destination which is the Kongston Fort as you can see. So guys finally we reached Frederick's Park. Let's go inside. So if you don't know about Frederick, so it's the fifth largest city in Norway. It won the most attractive city award in 2017. I can feel that vibe because it's so, so, so beautiful. generally build on the top of the hill so that they have upper hand and from their enemies and if you see inside I can imagine it must have some function at that age to view or to shoot Guys, what I really like about these foods are like obviously they're beautiful, it's from 1685. But then see the doors here, it's like so so pretty. I just want to get clicked with every door here. This is so pretty. So this fort was accompanied by a garden outside it which where you can have this awesome view or you can also chill here and there were not many people around. So this is the view you can see from here. I think you can see the entire Frederick station here. It's on the top. After a great time in Kongston Fort, now we are heading towards the center of the town. As 
as we reached the center we saw a lot more people here it is a touristy place where we saw this flea market and people were buying stuff shopping stuff so it was a full touristy feel here One other thing which makes Fredericksdorf very attractive for tourists is this ferry ride because it's free of cost and it connects old town and new town and it also connects the station so it is a very good thing we didn't try but you can surely try we also saw a lot of personal boats here that people carry their boats here also we saw this troy train here which you can always take and you can just have a round around the town so that was also very interesting so basically this place have all the things for a tourist attraction So after all the exploration we were really hungry so we came to this place and had a pizza so i totally recommend this place because the pizza was really good Another important fact that Fredrikstad is just 20 kilometers from Sweden border so a lot of Norwegians go to Sweden for Harry tour which is basically grocery shopping because it is much more cheaper in Sweden so we didn't wanted to waste the opportunity to because we were so close to the border we also went to Norby and we did our shopping there And yes we do agree some of the items are way cheaper in Sweden than Norway which I'll show you in some other video. So finally after a long day we are heading back to Norway. This was our short day trip to Fredrikstad. Hope you like it and you will visit this place. Bye bye.